hi everyone in this video you will learn about that how to pass a structure member in a function Stru passing a structure member to a function is very similar to passing a single integer to a function or passing a single character to a function or float or double or passing an array to a function is very similar to that you just need to follow the same method just the difference in the function calling so let me just explain you that this is the structure template which we have defined in this program the struct keyword this is the tag of the structure these are the three members of the structure integer a float b and the character array this is the function definition uh, function declaration in this function declaration here i have defined and declared an integer so this means that i need to pass an integer in the function while i am calling the function this is the definition of the main in this main definition we have initialized the structure the by the struct keyword this tag and this tag would be the same this is the variable of the structure so this 5 will go into a this 3.14 will go into b and this john will go into character array you have already learned that uh, how to initialize an array in the structure videos this is the function calling here i have passed the integer member that is the 5 in the function calling how i am passing it i am just taking the reference of it by the variable of the structure the dot operator and the member name that is a so the value of a is 5 so i am passing 5 here in the function definition uh, i am def declaring an integer a new integer this is how we did in when while we passed an integer in the functions and uh, while i was doing that with argument the f videos you have already seen that and this is in this line we have printed this integer so let me just compile it there is no error let me just run it see here 5 has been printed so we have pa we have just passed a member of the structure in a function in the next videos we will learn about that how to pass the whole structure and functions thank you